hey guys thank you so much for joining in today if you're new here please make sure to click the subscribe button and support your girl and if you're a returning subscriber thank you so much so today i decided to go around at two at the Mount state university actually it was fun because uh, the weather was nice everywhere was cool and i just said okay why not just take it through and show you guys around this is the just when you enter the front gate this is what you're going to see first and um for those of you that do not know the school is located in mubi of course which is not that building you're seeing there is a senate building um the school was established in january 2002 by the adamant state university law number 10 of 2001 and is located in Mubi town in the northern central district of Adamawa state as i've already said earlier on so this is just about it actually it has a very interesting fact it has a lot of interesting facts actually one of them is that i graduated from this school <laughs> yeah this is that that's the school chapel right there isn't it just beautiful in its glorious nature well this is it i i kind of just decided to stay here a bit because i was just appreciating the beauty of the whole color the painting the nature actually because when i was in uh when i was still a student it wasn't painted so you can't blame me so we're just leaving the church just going towards the multi-purpose hall this is just the way i i actually didn't my department my department was at the left sorry <laughs> Baza, please. Yeah, my department is at that other side but i didn't go there that was you find the faculty of social science as management around that's by the left yeah building you just saw now is the multi-purpose hall that's where all such activities take place there it's actually a big building but from where i was standing you won't actually see it well i'm just trying to go around the building so that you can actually see it very well so um i remember i wrote my final exam here <laughs> funny yeah i wrote it here but you know, this place is actually very nice uh, I love this place very well because the the seating capacity is very nice. I, I couldn't go inside the halls; they were locked. Sorry that I'm just showing you just the exterior. And by the left side is the science complex. Some people were working on the building, so I couldn't like show you um, the building well. But maybe with time, I will show you that. Yeah, the building facing me is i think this is the department of sciences yeah all the science department biochemistry zoology yeah all of them are at this building there you will soon see it yeah so i was getting closer to the building the blocks it's actually a very large large space you see it when I go in. Well, as we keep looking, I'll just be telling you some few facts you need to know about Adama State University. It is the first state-owned university in the northeast sub-region of Nigeria. Yeah. Okay, as well as Mubi is, we we actually have something to be proud of. We have a polytechnic, we have a university. I mean but those of you that do not know about Mubi, you're missing a lot and you should definitely visit because, <laughs> I mean, it would be one hell of a, an experience. This is just Adamo City University. I will do a YouTube video of um, Federal Polytechnic Mubi when I have the time and you will see the glorious nature of that school. In fact, it's bigger than Adamo City University. Anyways, um... The university was established with the goal of providing education for development. Yeah. 
and um, is a public owned university by Adama State Government. However, the law establishing the university provides for various funding from other organizations. So this is the science faculty. I'm just showing you the Department of Zoology. I think I showed you the Department of Chemistry, just this one right there. Yeah. When I was showing you guys the the first picture, uh, you saw this um our logo. It has actually different things on the logo. We have the green, that's the murky green color. It symbolizes the rich of vegetative potential of the state. When I was in secondary school, when I was in college, I, I, the, the lot of my classmates that were like, "You're from Madame City, You're from the North." Ah. Like they don't even believe that the north is a place that people can live in. And one of my classmates, I remember her saying that when she hear of the north, she always think of thatch houses, um, people living on the rock, <laughs> on the mountain. Can you imagine? So I was like, no. I mean, you you will even be surprised that some of the our states here in the north is like beautiful and you know very conducive for one to live in than some other states. Because if you come to Mubi, like the weather is nice, the the environment is cool and everything. Sorry guys, <laughs> I'm I'm talking a lot. So that's the girls hostel. Actually one of the girls hostel that was recently built. I couldn't go close because well <laughs> I was already getting tired, Ja. You know you you will not blame me. These ones are our lecture halls and that's the back view of the science complex I told you about earlier. Those, these ones are the, the lecture halls. We call it Ted Phone, Ted Phone 1, Ted Phone 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, blah, blah, blah. And that it goes. So, um, this building right here is the new library I heard. Because they started building right from when I was still a student. <laughs> Not like just too long ago, yeah. But it's still there. And this is the back view of the science department and yeah the library is a very very big library not like there's there's another library in the school but i think they are trying to construct another a new one and it looks really nice guys like really nice even before they complete the building i bet it's going to be really really nice so as i was saying the sun in the logo symbolizes the dawn of modern qualitative education and the yellow color provides peaceful existence so it's just um saying like you know we we at adam state university i was a student there so yeah it's we yeah that place is the fisheries fisheries department sorry guys um peaceful existence and the red and black dignity of labor and there's this area symbol which signals like this <laughs> sorry which symbolizes the desire to promote education in the northern states yeah know your logo guys <laughs> that's the boys who still actually sorry the girls who still there that's the ict uh, i think i'm gonna go like take a closer view for you guys so that you can actually see it well i was walking so <laughs> and i actually enjoyed the experience because the weather was okay it was not too sunny it was not too blah 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 you know that so that's the ict my friend and i usually go to read there sometimes but it's too quiet for my liking shop so our zone is usually in the c block <laughs> a block b block i will show you guys that later on in the video Yeah, so this is the front view of the ICT. Most of this building you see Ted Fund on are actually like, as I told you earlier, the law establishing the university provides for various funding. So they are funded by Ted Fund projects. These buildings are the staff quarters. They are like, they, from the way you're coming in from the main gate, there's a staff, there's one staff quarter there, but it's not really 
like big like this one so this is the main staff cutter this is the girls hostel it's a new girls hostel i have forgotten the name i think they call it i don't know i forgot the name of the hostel because it's a new hostel so i left that school without even knowing the real name of this hostel yeah And these ones are our hostels. I'm going to show you guys the the full view of the hostels proper. We're just walking towards them. And so if you go towards this road, is the road to our hostels. The first hostel is the Gambo Hall. I think they named these hostels according to you know um, people that were famous. I don't know, <laughs> maybe respectable men in our states. I think so. This is the Gumbo Hostel, and the hostels are all lined up in one place, except for those new ones that they built later on. This is the Gumbo Hostel, and the hostel I'm about to go to is a very special hostel. Yeah, right. This was my hostel, man. That is the constituency. That's the the place where guys play pool, you sit around, and fun fact, guys. If you come around here in the night, hmm. You know what you will see. Bunch of people sitting down on this place. <laughs> this got that. <laughs> yeah. And people you, they always say that sign up who still they pack a lot of guys. I don't know, but I I don't have any comment to say to that. But whenever you come to this place in the evenings or in the nights, ah a lot of people, a lot of guys will gather there. Sometimes you see people in two streets. So this is my beloved hostel, Zainab Hostel. I'll bus when I was a student, this was my hostel. Yeah, opposite Zena Hostel is our, um, what do I call it, our talk shop. We usually, um, where they sell things around there, photocopy, blah, blah, blah. Every school has that. So, um, and the next hostel is where we are going to. That's our, what do they call it? Gosh, I've forgotten a lot of things. When did I graduate? <laughs> yeah, behind that is Madagascar. <laughs> That's Madame BC. Sorry, I remember now. It's Madame BC. We call it. Yeah. This hostel is the Boni. No, oh, no, no. This is not Boni. This is Aisha Hall. Aisha Hall. I think the second best is Zena because after Zena is like the best. Please, no. <laughs> Nobody should attack me here. Then this is Aisha Hall. Hmm. I wonder who brought out this chest. Because if anybody find out, <laughs> I remember those days my friends would carry chair from this, this class and sneak it to the hostel. And if all these hostel matrons come, it's another Wahala. Anyways, so then we have we are past the exclusive hostels. <laughs> we are going to the other hostel, as I like to call it. This is the Chiruma Chiruma Hall another hostel the opposite the chiroma hall again this is our beloved wonderful love garden mm -hmm. you can see that again so this place what we call the love garden like everybody that has attended us so yeah opposite love garden is another hostel i think this is the boni that i was telling you guys about earlier this is the boni hostel so the boni hostel is opposite love garden and the Chiruma Hostel to is opposite the Love Garden. Anybody that has attended this school, Adam Awa State University, will be know about this Love Garden very well. If the person has either been there or heard about the story, so I'm not going to say any other thing. But it's a wonderful experience, guys. Like you don't you don't have to just come to university and just you know book 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 church 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 yeah those things are very essential but you have to leave like you know try to experience what it means to be on campus even if you don't do it you will see people doing it and be like wow even though like it's, we don't really have so much like problems here because the students i don't know maybe it's because of the way they are culturally raised but there's the way that people behave themselves here, unlike other schools. We, I don't think we've ever had any problem of 
riots or stuff sorry i'm talking too much this is the a block b block that is what we call it hmm. this class if you come here to read in this class just forget it. you're not going to read <laughs> i told you guys that me and my friends usually come there to read that's because we come there after light out but if you come there when there's light hmm, my brother my sister you're not going to be because the people that come to that class usually come to make noise charge their phone watch film blah 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 or flirt with girls so forget it <laughs> so um opposite that place the place if you go straight down that's the c block sorry i i didn't really show that place because i'll as i said i'm tired oh i cannot come and kill myself <laughs> Oh yeah, these ones are all full joints where you can come and eat charging points, blah blah blah. Yeah, so opposite there is the C block. Sometimes I read there too. And then this is our sick bay or clinic. Hmm. I don't have anything to say, Sha, about this clinic, but let me just reserve my comments or comment my reserve. Let's go further. <laughs> yeah, that's the ambulance. I, I, I don't know Sha because me ever since i came to invest i think i've only come to this place once or, once or twice maybe the, the last time i came was to come and do my clearance so yeah let's go let's move let's move let's move that building i think is one of the ice yeah that building there is the computer department yeah i couldn't go there because my battery was already getting low so i just wanted to be done and just finish this up see the kind of stress i'm going through for you guys yeah. but it was worth it like i was glad myself to do this because i just loved seeing the area how it looks very nice actually yeah these these are department department of marketing and i think the one behind it is the department of banking and finance i don't know and this is i think geography geography department yep Yeah, computer science department that's the computer science department i was just showing you and uh, this is the front view i think there are some lecturers that are still present maybe marking maybe compiling i don't know but some offices were indeed open faculty of science That school bus there that you're seeing parked there since I came to that school, it has not moved from there. I think it's fault. But we have other school buses, so please don't disrespect us. We have like three or four now. We have other school buses. If I can remember clearly, we went for discussion with two of them. This is our library for now. Yeah, this is the library we use for now. But our, sorry, their. <laughs> no, it's our because I'm, I'm an alumni, so. Our library is still in progress, the one I showed you guys earlier, but this is the one we use for now, the university library. The whole place is quite shy. I didn't even miss people, I didn't miss much people, there are a few people, so... Abdurrahman Gaji Library. I don't know why they give them. I don't even know the guy, the man, sorry. But that's the name of the library. So just going out through the small gates though. I couldn't go I couldn't pass through there because it was locked. And yeah, this is the Department of Bi Educational Foundation, blah blah blah. This this that is still the library, the one with the blue roof. This is the faculty of education. State University. There's some of these places that I haven't really like giving them much of my attention because I don't know. I, I didn't have any business with them, but I can't believe that I was filming other departments and I didn't film my department. Damn. 
maybe next time guys i'll just it, my youtube video will be dedicated to my department alone i will just film my department that's the faculty of agriculture they have plenty places i think faculties i don't know but i think this is one of them because they have another one around there yeah so this is this is part of the agricultural faculty too since i came to that school i always loved this place and i always i only went there once a very beautiful place if you enter inside So guys i'm on my way out actually but just showing you the places that i might have not showed you earlier in the video i i don't i think um these places are there are also departments but i'm not really sure which one so I don't want to lead you guys astray, but yeah, but this this I was just on my way out, so I just said, okay, let me just film this place that I, I, I didn't film. Yeah, I didn't I didn't follow this road. I followed the other road that leads to the chapel. In case you're wondering, so this is the postgraduate. I think they are hall or their no, their department actually. Department of Education this is the parking lot. So um the one facing me directly, the yellow one, the one yeah, that one there is the postgraduate hall. They have their lectures there and the generator. Department of Science Education, Faculty of Education. Yeah, this, that was the faculty of education behind. And then this is other staff quarters I was telling you guys about that I didn't Oh, I did. I did earlier. We usually take our passport at this joint. National Association of Science Education Students. Yeah, it's just there. Yeah, so I'm on my way out. And you can see the Senate building from where I was standing. That's our football field. We actually have two football fields. I didn't film the, the other one. But this is one of them. Just when you're entering the school, you see this by your right i think that's our football field i think that they are constructing it or maybe they are just i don't know but th those poles are new i didn't see them there before yeah so i'm going out of the school i hope that um in case someone comes here he won't be lost because um at least i've tried my best to explain places even though it wasn't explicit but uh, it's a summary and i did my best to explain at Mount state university to you the buildings the places you can see how beautiful it looks seriously i'm crushing on it myself i don't know if it's the weather but I love it yeah this is just outside the gates I'm going home, guys. Bye-bye. <laughs> so, this is just outside the gate. Thank you so much, guys, for tuning in. Please don't forget to subscribe. I love you guys. Mwah.